here we go. So on the left hand side is the new transition into ARC 3 in mu score, which sounds like this. And on the right hand side is the animation of that transition. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Vision and Sound Part 28 Debrief. In today's episode, we re-entered by reflecting on a bunch of stuff. Um, tuning the Do4 animation, which you're looking at on the right-hand side, has been informing the Do4 score, which is on the left-hand side, and vice versa. Now, we've experienced this before, but it kind of came to the fore. So we're pretty much sure we're done with Do 4. And so it seems like we're at a new crux point on, on what to work on next. Out of nowhere, um, we got a nice visit from Fox Creative Gaming, and we did an interactive on-the-fly uh, demo tutorial with them here, where we talked about default tempos, default dynamics, making a score from scratch, and intervals. And they had a SoundCloud sample that we transcribed just a piece of for them. So that was quite delightful. So that's definitely along the line of at a crux point to what we do next. So what we're going to do for you is just play the transition points showing you what's happening here. Basically, what happened is we we softened we softened to mezzo piano. We dropped arc three's volume, and we dropped arc four's volume to the same thing. And then at arc five, we put them back up to mezzo forte. It turns out because there's two parts playing together on arc five, we get a double mezzo forte effect and so that actually gets reflected here so we're just going to play the very last part of this animation where we kind of transition from arc four which is um uh, well the other thing we did is you'll notice that arc one the pink actors down here arc two the pink actor jumped up arc three it jumped up even more so we kind of visually pushed that actor up each time. That was a 0.6, a 0.4, a 0.2, and a 0. But then at arc 5, they go to the 0, the 2, which is pretty much what this was. But then they're also allowed to play, uh, it, like we said, the volume's louder, so it comes through louder. So what we want to do is play from about here. Very soft. So that concludes today's stream. What we like about this, as we said, is the the t getting the animation to do something eventually led us back to doing something with the score. And we experimented quite a bit, but these transitions between the arcs are, are now kind of a blend of the subtle and the obvious. Yay. Uh, and 
another thing we noticed is the representation of the loud double part in arc five. When you look at the recording, you can actually see the pink actor jumping much higher and the trails have little high peaks. So even though they're subtle and not as obvious as the bright pink triangle, the, the fading trails are visually matching the, the aural loudness. So we like that. Um, our ideas for next time are to post recording the Dove 4, uh, to perhaps make a demo score of our interactive section session with Fox Creative Gaming and to be determined. So shout outs to Silent Lurker, Fox Creative Gaming, and Committed Listener. We appreciate you. Tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care. Do come back and do keep on streaming.